Plastic alloy is not a metal. It is actually two different plastics, or three different plastics, or more different plastics. Then by that certain means, turn it into a composite. Then the composite material I just talked about is, for example, two materials. For example, PC. Let's take PC plus ABS as an example. First of all, PC it has a better rigidity. That PC's impact resistance is actually very good. Then the PC also has a good transparency. But there's a downside to PC. PC is not well processed. Then PC liquidity is generally poor. Because PC is easy to generate internal stress. And then what are the benefits of ABS? ABS has a very good processability first. It is also very good coloring. It is very good color matching. So most of the appliances, basically, ABS is used to make electrical enclosures. When PC plus ABS, it will be able to play its respective advantages. For example, after adding ABS to PC, first of all, it's easier to shape. Because ABS, it makes up for the bad molding of PC. That because of the addition of ABS, then make the internal stress of PC cracking. This phenomenon has also been improved. So a feature of ABS is played, reflected in the PC, that at the same time PC added to ABS. Another one that raises the ABS, strength and heat resistance. The thermal deformation of ABS is only about 85 degrees. Then the thermal deformation of PC will usually reach 120. That by PC, ABS if the PC content is relatively high, it will also significantly increase its thermal deformation. So the result of this alloy is 1 加 1. Functional above cannot say greater than 2, but it's not as simple as 1 加 1 at all. It will become a new one material characteristics. Embodied, then the new one of this material features on the usual call it plastic alloy.